I'm Tom Merritt from Daily Tech News Show. Here are our top five travel tech picks. Traveling is stressful, and tech can make it more stressful or less stressful. Kind of depends on who's running the tech, right? And what tech we're talking about. We can't do anything about the TSA scanning machine going down or the in-flight screens breaking, but we can help you pick some personal tech to make your trip a little more enjoyable. And we got links to all this stuff down below in the comments and on our website. Here are the top five travel tech picks. Number five, power. You need a power brick for recharging your devices. And if you're traveling internationally, an adapter to the local power plug standard. So for the power brick, look for something like the Zendur Super Mini 20 Watt, a small and light 10,000 milliamp hour battery that has both USB-C and USB-A ports. For the power adapter, I would look for something like the Epica, which also has USB ports. And if you like USB ports on a single wall plug, you could try the Anchor 747 charge it's not international, but it is a GAN charger, meaning it will charge your devices up pretty fast. Coming in at number four, headphones. Any decent pair of wired headphones is a good backup. That way you can plug into something like the airplane headphone jacks. And of course, noise canceling headphones are great. Everybody seems to love the over the ear Sony WH-1000XM5s. But if you want something smaller, just go with Apple AirPods or Samsung Galaxy Buds. And if you're using wireless headphones of any kind, check out the AirFly Pro. It connects to an airplane headphone jack or any headphone jack and then converts the audio to Bluetooth so you can use your wireless headphones. Up to number three, a handheld luggage scale. If you've ever been at the airport trying to pull things out of bags and put them in other bags and trying to meet that mysterious weight limit, you're going to want this. The Atexity luggage scale wraps around the handle of your luggage and then you just lift it up for a couple of seconds and it gives you a weight estimate, and it's pretty accurate. We can't explain why the weight limits vary so much from one airline to another, but we can help you know how much your luggage weighs. Sliding into number two, entertainment. For eBooks, people universally seem to love the Kindle Paperwhite because it has a nice, easy to read screen and it's pretty lightweight. When you get to the hotel, you might want to have a Chromecast or a Roku streaming stick on you. You can plug that right into the TV and stream all your favorite video without logging into a hotel TV and forgetting to uh, log out and leaving your credentials on there. Or you might just want to carry a good old fashioned HDMI cable and just plug that into your laptop. At number one, tracking tags. Whether you use Tile or Apple's AirTags, you might want one in each of your bags, on any keys or purses you carry, and maybe even on things like cameras and other items. I could go on, especially if we got into cable organizers, backpacks, and more, but I feel like this covers the essentials. And I'd like to know what your favorite travel tech is. Let us know in the comments or at feedback at dailytechnewsshow.com. Speaking of the comments, in our YouTube video description and on our website, we've got links to all the stuff we talked about here if you want to check it out. And if you want more great tech news and info, go to the same places, youtube.com slash dailytechnewsshow and get the podcast at dailytechnewsshow.com. I'll see you there.